Here is a quick update of our fish room. Me and my father's fish room here. This is um, his 2012 gallon tank, a little barb tank here. He has bought some Java moss here, which is, you know, attached to this driftwood here. And he bought a couple of snails for this tank here, bought a couple of nearites. Which, um... They're not visible right now. Oh, here's one right here, right by the boat. <laughs> there's one near right, right there. And there's another one. Flown around somewhere. <laughs> And these plants over here, he had recently got the, these cryptocorns. He recently got them from our local fish store. There's nice looking plants here. And he uh, bought another moss ball. And the one behind it is really taken off greatly. I can see some new growth on it. And this one in the front here, this new one, will soon be taken off soon. And this one over here, the new one, started to branch out a little bit, I notice. And this school of tiger barbs and this, and the one green quarry here. And they're all hanging out together. <laughs> All the snails here. All the mystery snails. And let's take a look at the cichlid tank here. Here's Flipper and Jerry. And here is Flippy. And Grumpy's in this cave somewhere. I think I see him right there, all the way in the left hand corner. Oh my mistake, that one right there is Flippy, right behind Flipper. And yeah, that one coming out of the cave, that's Flippy. And here's Cream Puff. And this tank is doing extremely well as well. And I'm going to show you the newest addition to our mini fish room here. The 10 gallon guppy tank that my father had recently set up here. Today he, um, well just the other day he uh, bought some java moss here. And yesterday he had bought some of this water wisteria right here. And he went ahead today to our local fish store and bought a couple of guppies. This nice looking pair here. And also a ramshorn snail. This guy is really cool. And the guppy that was once in the 20 tall tank, she's right over here. She's pregnant. Right there. She's just resting up. But she's perfectly active so there's two female and one male guppy in this tank this is officially the male I mean the guppy tank here uh, this is the 10 gallon guppy tank so my father has a different species of tanks, one 29 gallon cichlid tank and the 20 tall barb tank and the 10 gallon guppy tank. <laughs> this is a nice pair of guppies, they are, really are nice. I really like that yellow color fin on the male. It's a really nice color. As well as the female. 
Let's just take another glimpse at the female, other female here, who she's pregnant. And let's take a look at my tanks here. How well my fish are doing. <laughs> My Ambunas, you know, the usual gang, my four T barbs, my two pearl convicts. And over here in my keyhole cichlid. <laughs> Everyone in this tank, my three quarries. My two angels. There's one. And uh, where's the other one? Is he hiding? Oh, here he is. <laughs> Here's the other angel. <laughs> I guess he came out for the camera. <laughs> These angels are doing extremely well. Every fish that we have are doing extremely excellent. Health-wise, you know, all five of my Garamis. And my Bolti is in my Cichlid tank here. They love that corner, all four of them. And that was the three out of the four. I don't know where the other one is. It could be behind that sponge filter. There is my uh, one Ambona right here, Sunshine. <laughs> and the other one, Sapphire. These guys I've had for a little while, maybe a Going up to two years, I've probably had these two in bonus. That's great. It seems that long already. Our tanks are absolutely amazing. The five of our tanks and a mini fish room. <laughs> Let's take a peek back at my father's tanks. Uh, the cichlid tank here. Look at that striking resemblance on Jerry. He is awesome. Just like that blue color, you know, and the yellow color on him. It's really cool looking. And Grumpy, unfortunately, we didn't get to see. I guess he didn't want to come out tonight. <laughs> and here's my one convict in there. I mean, his convict, I'm sorry. Well, he is in there. He, you can see a little bit of him. Because he blends in so well with the rocks, you know. You can see, you can see his front gills moving. <laughs> I just love the bubble activity in all these tanks. Absolutely love it. As well as every living thing in these tanks. I see a little bit of Grumpy. He's way, way back there in the left hand corner. You can see a little bit of him.
And the back of my his 20 tall tank. His 20 tall gallon barb tank. I just love the way this moss looks on this driftwood here. This Java moss here. Looks really cool on this driftwood. And here are some of the barbs here having a social hangout. Here's one of the neorites. <laughs> Still know where the other one is. He's probably in the boat by some chance. It's a pretty cool looking here, right? <laughs> and that's our tanks, you know, including the new uh, 10 gallon guppy tank, which has been recently set up. And there is more to come. Alright, bye bye.